Hi, I'm Tatiana, and today I'm gonna to teach you how to deep clean your teeth without a dentist. I don't have access to a dentist right now, and I don't know if you do either. We're on lockdown for the next month, and I want my teeth feeling fresh and clean. So I have some tools that I'll be sharing with you in this video on how I deep clean my own teeth. Now, I'm not a dentist, I'm not a dental hygienist. So clean your teeth at your own risk. But these are some basic tools that you can find in just about any store or you can order them online. So stay tuned to watch and I'll show you how I deep clean my teeth at home. Okay, first you wanna wash your hands thoroughly before you brush your teeth because you will, are going to be touching your mouth and your face, so just make sure you're clean. And then also wash your utensils thoroughly as well. And then use warm water to wet everything and then go ahead and dry everything and put it in a separate spot all ready to go okay i just washed my hands once more just because i touched everything and i just want to make sure that i'm super clean and ready to wash my mouth Okay, so first you can start with floss and you basically wrap it around your finger and get a tight grip. Then in the mirror, you can look at your teeth. Start. You can start from the bottom and you want to hug each tooth. So by hugging the tooth, you're going to put the floss all the way down on the tooth into the gum. And if your gums bleed, that just means that you need to do this more often. Uh, you should be doing about once a day and you'll get stronger gums from doing so. But And then I use uh, clean water to rinse it out. Then this little thing has a rubber end on it and it just basically gets anything that might be stuck from between the gums after flossing. And then I use this pick to remove any plaque that might be around my teeth. I especially get this on the bottom row of my teeth because they're all so close together. You can see that one of my tooth is uh, crooked because they're so close together. But anyway, so that's where a lot of the plaque builds up. And so I'm using this pick to break down the plaque and then remove it. And then in doing so, I'm also uh, rinsing out the pick every once in a while just so that I can um, get rid of all of the plaque and then I rinse out my mouth with water then I use this little sander it's it feels like a sandpaper and I'm basically removing any of the plaque that is on the front of my teeth so I'm just gonna go from tooth to tooth if it has a rough sound it's probably because there is plaque and if it's smooth it's probably because there it, you're done so I'm just gonna keep doing this until it's all smooth and then I um, also turn the sander so I can get the other rough spots of the sander and then I will rinse out my mouth and then I also do the top portion of my teeth and I just try to get as much off as possible Okay, now I'm going to use this tongue scraper and basically I'm just going to rinse it off just that first and start from the back of my tongue and scrape it forward. And I'll do this about two or three times until I get all of the uh, dirt from my tongue off. Then I'll take my toothbrush and put it in some toothpaste and wet my toothbrush and then start from the back of my teeth and start in a circular motion around my mouth. So I'll go from the top to the bottom and then I'll also get the tops of my teeth and then I'll also get the backs of my teeth really well as much as possible. If it foams up too much you can spit out and then keep going but this is Basically, it just takes time and patience, but the more you do in a circular motion, the better. Then I will brush my tongue just to remove any 
dirt that might have gotten on my tongue after brushing my teeth and then I'll rinse out my mouth about three times and then this is an extra step I don't usually do this but uh, just to keep things as sanitary as possible I'm using mouthwash which has alcohol in it to sanitize my mouth so the, it's a little bit too strong for me so I add water and I will um, swish it around in my mouth for about 30 seconds to a minute and then rinse it out. And then I'll also rinse it out with another gargle of water. And then um, I'm done. And here's my smile. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this was helpful. If you're quarantined in your house and you can't get to a dentist, I hope this helps you feel that deep cleaning that you might be needing and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Thanks. Bye.